doesn't look like my bedroom. This doesn't look like my house. This doesn't look like any place I've ever been. Hello. Uh, hi. May I help you? I think you've done quite enough. What are you talking about? You were supposed to help me. Help you with what? I don't even know who you are. You know who I am. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't tell people I don't know who they are if I really do know who they are. Oh, God, that's a tongue twister. Whatever. But you were supposed to help me, and now I'm sick. You're sick? What do I have to do with that? You were supposed to help me. Help you with what? Who are you? You know who I am. Can't believe you didn't help me. I can't believe you. But I didn't do anything. What? I didn't do anything. Please. I didn't do anything. Grace? I didn't do anything. Grace? Grace, huh, huh? What's the matter? What? You were yelling in your sleep saying I didn't do anything. What's wrong? Nothing, just, just a dream. Well, obviously. What was it about? Nothing. Something stupid. Well, if it was something stupid, how come you're ashamed to share it? Because it was stupid. What was it about? Chris, let's just go back to sleep. I'll be, I'm fine. Are you sure? You don't want me to get mom? No, I'm fine. She's okay. I'm only trying to help you out. Wait, Krista. What? I'm sorry. I don't mean to yell at you. It's just the dream really confused me. Okay, but you feel better if you, if you talked about the dream? It's really weird. What was it about? I dreamt I was in this strange place, and this girl who I'd never even met before, she comes over to me and she blame, she accuses me of not helping her and of ignoring her. Who was this person? I don't know. I've never seen her before. That is weird. You gotta lay off the sweets before bed. Chris, uh, are you sure you're okay, Grace? Yeah, I'm fine. Go back to sleep. I'm okay. Are you sure? Yeah, just go back to sleep. Okay. Good night. <sighs> hey, Mom, I'm home. Hi, honey. Did you have a good day at school? Hmm? Nothing special. Listen, I'm glad you're home. Um, I really need to talk to you about something. Um, okay. You know, your sister is very worried about you. And your teachers are worried about you. How do you know my teachers are worried about me? They called me. They said that you just didn't seem to be paying attention in class. Has this been going on for a while? Well, Grace, you know you can tell me anything, don't you? Yeah. Well, then what's wrong, honey? Well, I keep having this really disturbing dream. Okay? Is that it? What do you mean, is that it? Don't you even care? You're the one that... Honey, what I mean is... Is that all you want to tell me? Well, what else do you expect me to tell you? Well, maybe what the dream is about? The dream is about... Like, I'm in this place, and this girl who I've never seen before... She comes and accuses me of not helping her. And I don't even know this person. I've never even seen her before. Oh, I see. So what do you think the dream means, Mom? Honey, I wish I knew what to tell you. But maybe you should try going to bed early tonight. That's your advice? Just to go to bed early? And risk having that dream again? Honey, how long have you been having these dreams? A few weeks. I just thought they were some freak thing, but when I had them over and over, really... Honey, why didn't you come to me? I don't know. I mean, I didn't want to bother you um, over a stupid dream. 
Well, it's obviously not stupid if it's bothering you this much. Would you like to sleep in my room with me tonight? Mom, I'm not five years old anymore. Thanks for asking, though. You're welcome. I better get my homework done. Oh, Grace, hmm? Your sister and her friend are studying you. I won't just start, Mom. I'll just grab my laptop and I'll work in the kitchen. All right. My gosh, our teacher's really loading us up. Tell me about it. Hey, Chris. Hey. Uh, Chris, Christy, this is my sister, Grace. Hi. Uh, hi. Grace, are you okay? Yeah, I'm perfectly fine. I just came in to grab my laptop. Oh, there it is. Okay. Your sister's weird. Tch, you don't know the half of it. Why is your sister freaking out like that? I think I might know. I have this crazy idea that I know what's going on. Well, what do you think is going on? I'll tell you as soon as I figure it out. Okay. Grace? Huh? Oh, hey, Krista. What's going on with you today? What do you mean? Grace, I'm not blind. I never said you were. Well, I'm not stupid either. I didn't say you were stupid either. Well, then what's the matter? You seemed fine, but then when you saw Christy, you freaked out. Why? Because she looks just like her. Because she looks like who? That girl in my dream. Oh, really? She's like completely identical to that person. Well, that's weird. You say you said you've never seen this person before. I had to have seen her subconsciously. Maybe when I was at the store or something. Well, maybe. But is that why you're freaking out? Because she resembles the girl in your dream? It's more complicated than that. Well, explain it to me then. I don't know. It just freaks me out because... Because why? I have a feeling Christy or whatever her name is. Christy, yeah. Well, I have a feeling she's going to need my help and I won't be able to help her. Hello, Christy is my friend. You don't have to do anything for her. I guess. Grace, you really got to shake this dream stuff out. Don't you think I'm trying to? Yeah. Try harder. <sighs> Uh, hey, Christy. Hey, is everything okay with the sister? Yeah, she's just freaking out. Why? You look like somebody she had a dream about. I do. Who? Grace says she doesn't know who the person is, but you're like practically identical to the girl in her dream. Really? Is that why she seems really uncomfortable around me? Afraid so. <laughs> What's so funny? I can't believe Grace is upset to see me because of some stupid dream. I mean, how old is she? Look, Christy, I agree with you that it's weird Grace is having dreams like that, but they obviously bother her. Well, I don't mean to bother her. It's not my fault she dreams about me not knowing about it. I know, it's nobody's fault. It's not even her fault. What does she even think about before she goes to bed? I don't know. I'm her sister, not her detective. Maybe I should talk to Grace myself. Why? I think she's uncomfortable around him. That's why I gotta talk to her. Gotta break the ice sometime. Relax. I'll go talk to her. Okay, but if she throws something at you... Oh, for, don't worry about it. Hey, Grace. <gasps> Oh, hi. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> Just fine. No, you're not. What is going on? Nothing, nothing's going on. Your sister's really worried about you. Well, she's my sister. Of course she's going to worry about me. Well, I don't even know you, but I'm worried about you. You don't have to worry about me. 
I'm fine, really. Your sister told me about the dream you had. Oh, Krista told you? Yeah. Do I really look, look a lot like that girl in your dream? You do. And I'm sorry I didn't help you or whatever. Grace, it was a dream. Well, then why, the, why did I dream about you in particular? I only met you today. Dreams aren't controllable. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm really sorry for the way I've been acting around you. I'm just, I'm just uncomfortable. I know you're uncomfortable around me. And I'm sorry to hear that. Is there anything I can do to make you comfortable with me? I don't know. Maybe if I look past the dream and look at you, then that would be a good place to start. Yeah. Why don't you go in our bedroom with Chris? I'll be there in a minute. Are you sure you're going to be okay? I'm sure. Okay. <sighs> so, did you get things settled with, with you and Grace? Yeah, but I don't think Grace is ever going to feel comfortable around me. You don't have to worry about that. Grace, how long have you been standing there? I just got in here. Look, Grace, I'm really sorry if I'm making you uncomfortable. Maybe I should leave. You don't have to leave, but you're uncomfortable about me. Look, I know I dream about you every night, and I don't know why, but... That doesn't mean I can't like you as a person. Well, I kind of like you too. You're my best friend's sister. Who's your best friend? Krista! I'm your best friend? Yeah, you are. You've always been my best friend. But Grace, um, so you're not uncomfortable around me? Not as much. I mean, that's all I made you uncomfortable. It's not your fault, Christy. It's just those dreams I have. They're so unsettling. I know. Believe it or not, my sister is just like you. What do you mean? She has dreams about a girl needing help, too. Does your sister know who the girl is? She looks kind of like you. What? Oh, my gosh, this is so weird. <laughs> I'm just kidding. She didn't tell me who the girl looked like. She just said that it was a girl she never met. And she just... She's just bothered by the dream. Please, man, know how that feels. I'm bothered by the dream. I'm sorry if I'm uncomfortable to look at. You're not. You're not. I was acting really stupid. Just because you look like somebody in my dream doesn't mean you're dangerous or anything. Well, I should hope not. <laughs> okay. I'm glad you two are becoming friends but me and Chris, but Christy, me and you have some homework to do. All right, all right. I'll get the homework done. Yes. I'm gonna go um grab a snack. Any of you want anything? No, I'm fine. I'm fine too. All right. I'm gonna continue doing my homework um at the kitchen table so you guys can have privacy. Um. Okay. All right. She gonna be okay? Yeah, I think so. Thank you.